Tension as UK formally recognizes Nigeria as Islamic State amid ongoing war between Israel and Hamas. Is Nigeria now an Islamic State? Welcome to the news and thank you for tuning in to listen. Please subscribe to our channel. To get notified when we post our juicy news updates, please click on the notification bell. David Cameron, the Foreign Secretary of the United Kingdom, formally recognized Nigeria as an Islamic State at diplomatic meetings with Muslim and Arab countries with the ob objective of resolving the continuing issue Hamas conflict. This acknowledgement is consistent with the recent deal mediated by Israel and Hamas, which centered on synchronized captive releases and a four-day ceasefire. Following Secretary promises to working closely with Islamic nations on the Israel Gaza conflict at the Lancaster House meeting. Cameron emphasized how urgently humanitarian groups need to have greater access to fuel. Consequently, they would be free to continue their vital life-saving duties such as powering hospitals and desalination facilities which provide 80% of Gaza's water supply. According to the announcement, the London event was attended by foreign ministers from major countries like Saudi Arabia, Jordan, Egypt, the Palestinian Authority, Turkey, Indonesia, and Nigeria. During the joint Arab-Islamic Extraordinary Summit in Riyadh on November 11th, this group was constituted as a peace committee. They are now touring the cities of the permanent members of the UN Security Council, including Nigeria. The foreign secretary covered tactics to rekindle diplomatic effort towards workable two-state solution that guarantees security for both Israelis and Palestinians during the talks. He also restated how strongly the UK condemned the recent upsurge in settler violence in the West Bank. Cameron reaffirmed the United Kingdom resolve to continue supporting effort to stop a wider regional escalation, extending this comment extending this commitment to nations like Yemen and Lebanon. Today, I led the conference of leaders from Arab nations and other Islamic government on the institution in Israel and Gaza, said Foreign Secretary David Cameron in his own words. The deal struck last night presents a critical chance to free the captive and increase humanitarian supplies to Gaza in order to support the Palestinian people. We spoke about how to utilize this advancement to reflect on the future and how we might create a tranquil future that offers Israel security while also bringing stability and peace to the Palestinian people. The government of the United Kingdom has announced a significant increase in funding to the occupied Palestinian territories, indicating a rise in involvement. Remarkably, 50, remarkably 30 million euros have been set aside which is more than double the system promise that he that has been made for the year, which is 27 million euros. This diplomatic move demonstrates a shared commitment to tackling the intricate issues raised by the Israel Gaza, Gaza conflict and represent a major step forward for international collaboration. Now, I beg. Islamic Islamic State at diplomatic meeting with Muslim. What's in Nigeria they do there? Hey, hey, hmm. Okay, <laughs> these people now play these people deal. Well, like the line, I play them day. Is Nigeria is not? I will never be an Islamic State. Ah. What's in that? Wait, wait now. What in Nigeria did you do for that meeting? Because let us go back. <laughs> so make it not be like say my year depending now. Tension as UK formally recognizing Nigeria as Islamic State. Now they do not say it with amount, but listen to why this thing because some people will still not understand why I'm saying this. Now look at the list of countries. They say according to the announcement, the London event was attended by foreign ministers from major countries. Listen. For major countries like the Saudi Arabia, Jordan, Egypt, the Palestinian Authority, Turkey, Indonesia. What in Nigeria they do there? And believe me, Nigeria is the only country from West Africa there. I think so. I don't see Uganda there. Eh? I don't see Ghana there. I don't see Kenya. 
Kill one back a water day waka waka waiting day waka waka they go. I be they just this is just to gain traction because I don't understand if this is true. <laughs> okay, God save Nigeria Nigerians from all this trouble. I'm telling you, the troubles are beginning to see. It can't be like saving Palestine away, they will better pass this country. How they tell you. <laughs> Truly, Nigeria is an Islamic state. If it were a Christian state, Obi would have won election period. Don't say that. Don't say that, please. Ha. Before Uncle, President and Vice President, Muslim. What do you expect? If Nigeria is not a Muslim state, then why Islamic terrorists everywhere in the country supported by Muslim preachers? It is only God that will save Nigeria. All Nigerian Christians voted for P2B. Why half of Nigerian Muslims voted for Turimba and he won? Nigeria is no doubt an Islamic state. Let me keep, let me tell you people, you people are deceiving yourselves. Hmm. There are actually Christians who voted for Tunumbu because of Alatenuje. And I don't think they voted for even P2B and Tunumbu based on religion in the southern part of the country. You can say in the north for that in our north now. We cannot go talk past my mouth. You, you can say in the north for that in our north. But if you say in the south, nah. British people, the evil people, but they will soon become a 53 state of America. Why you are lazy people? This is absolute nonsense and the news born out of suggestion that Nigeria is an Islamic state. Yes, but the thing is, Nigeria is in that particular gathering, which me, I'm even saying, I hope, say, maybe, I am, <laughs> maybe this is just to gain, uh, what's it called, traction or just to, this is foul news. Because they did not write and they don't talk, say, oh, this Nigerian person talks, see, or this Nigerian person don't talk to or they acknowledge you, oh, so, 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 person from Nigeria went there, and this is what they said. That Nigeria, okay, they, 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 this is absolute nonsense, and the news bore no eyes of suggestion that Nigeria is an Islamic state. This crooked false news puzzler have a twisted mind to plunge the country into crisis. He must be a merchant of war. The UK government, are you working secretly with Tunumbu to 